God damn, finally, there's been so many protests about the earth, about film and TV, about the government keeping secrets and pretending that aliens don't exist, but fuck that, nah, screw that shit, I ain't even listening to you when you talk about that nonsense. I have finally found a protest I care about. They, these pigs in suits and corpo espionage TW4Ts, twat, these corporate whiny pigs in suits are ruining the very world we live in. You will not believe what the government is trying to do. They are trying to ban G-strings. A G-string is a piece of kit that makes you look like that. Now that is obviously female. I wear them personally because, you know, I, I, I think they're comfy, bro. I like the way my balls hang out of them, all right? Call me crazy, call me wild. It makes me feel comfortable. It makes me feel content. They want to be they's instead of he slash she's or whatever. I want to be we able to wear a thong in public or a G-string. Whatever the topic, whatever the weather, I want it out, baby. I want it out. So, in the Gold Coast, if you don't know what the Golden Coast of Australia is, it's a Golden Coast in Australia. Yeah. Thanks for that. And uh, he is basically won the Volunteer of the Year award. Who the fuck cares? And he basically said, people, because not only women, all right, men can wear G-strings, are cheapening themselves. Now, as you can imagine, the women who were cheapening themselves and me did not appreciate this statement. So throngs of thongs wearing protesters bared their bombs on Australia's Gold Coast as they showed their opposition to call for a ban on G-string bikini bottoms. Well, you know, I was there. I, I had my pitchfork. I had my... AK-47 strapped to my bag like in an American high school and a Glock caught between my G-string and my trousers. And I tell you what, I was there representing. Were you? Were you there? No. Now, these lot showed up at 6 a.m. local time. Holy hell. Yes, we did. I mean, I was there. And we, we fought for our country. We fought for violence and to get things out. How dare they try and ban my thong? I want to wear a fucking thong. All I want to, all right? This is not for you to decide. My G-strings, my thongs make me look fucking good, bro. Just because you're overweight, out of fashion, and smell like fucking cheese sticks that have gone out of date because your grandma forgot to turn on on a fridge last year does not mean I need to stop wearing them, okay? So the fact he's actually said that and saying, you know, this Ian Grace, like who the f is Ian Grace? <laughs> Just to hear those All right, so he's not actually that popular for enough to actually come up when you arrive. Oh, he's here. Oh, it he, he might be him. All right, that's Ian Grace. So, look, I'm not gifted with many, uh, you know, good looks. I've got a fat fucking everything. Penis. Into penis. Except waistline because goddamn I squat, you know that girl. And he wants to ban him that with that with that beer nose. Like what is that shit? Get that cut off. That's infected. He wants to ban G strings and thongs. Now G strings. G string. Jesus. 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 And thong. Jesus. Jesus. I need a new mouse. It keeps dying. How dare they? Stop trying to send me notifications, you dick. Try and ban G-strings. The debate. There's not a debate, bro. You can't control what people wear. There are beaches. I know this because I was um, uh, just walking along a beach and happened to find one. There are nudist beaches in new, uh, in Europe. You can go there and show off your privés. It's mainly old people, grannies, you know, saggy breasts, you know, testicles that sort of hit the ankles when they walk. Them type of people go. But how can you ban a G-string. What's wrong with a G-string? I think they're cool, man. They really let you, you know, circulation flow to the ball area. They make you look cool, not to mention. But, like, what else would girls wear? Like, trunks? You know what I mean? Are they gonna wear, like, long sleeve trousers? You know, I, I just think it's quite outrageous. Poor guys as well, don't forget the guys. I'm gonna have to find something else to wear. But yeah, this Ian Grace is a bit of a donkey wonky. While any man would enjoy the view, I believe women are very much demeaning and cheapening themselves, portraying themselves as a sex object. How dare you presume I enjoy the view, bro? I just like seeing my own testicles float side to side, one on the right, one on the left. It's not my fault, all right? Took the willy in between, uh, what? Uh, but you know what I mean? Like, it's truly not your choice what I wear, mate. Go f yourself and go k yourself because this is not for you. I will literally come to your house in AK-47. The entire, your entire patio. I will ruin your front garden. I will take a massive dumperoony where your dog likes to do its privates. He will be so off-put. He won't be the same type of dog because he knows some other creature has basically destroyed his territory. That's what I'll do to you. Finally given in. But yeah, all seriousness though, they can't ban thongs. You can't ban what people wear, man. You can wear what you like. Men especially, we love to get our thongs out. Stop being a dick. Look, I know this has absolutely nothing to do with the video, but I found this really cute little story by about a monkey. <laughs> a cheeky monkey spent five days running in the Scottish Highlands doing really well and captured and returned to my life. So he went and he escaped and he was tempted by a Yorkshire pudding that had been left out overnight for the birds. <laughs> Is that not adorable? Is that not adorable? And then he was shot. He was shot. I repeat, the bird, the monkey was shot after he was spotted eating from a bird feeder in a garden. <laughs> That's adorbs. That's adorbs. But yeah, 
cute monkey, I know, but I actually wanted to talk about thongs. You wear thongs, send me lots of pictures in the comments down below. I want to see them because I, I don't believe you do, all right? Get your thongs out for Wong's out. Get your thongs out and I'll give you a bong out. No, this is fantastic. Hold up. No, I mean, this is not fantastic. This is terrible news. If you want to fight the protest, I've got a Discord in the description. Click it and join it. Do something cool. Let's start a movement. Let's create some violence. Now, cheers for watching. Though. I'm Literally, I'm losing the will to live at this stage of my life.